Raymond K. Roberts, 1527 Sheffield. I'm going to quote a local lawyer here in my speech. Dinosaurs, Civil War, founding fathers. You are public officials. So if someone gets heated, someone starts fighting with you, you should accept that because our founding fathers, that is what they did. They fought. They argued. They got it. Oh, of course, it's hurt souls, by the way. If you can't handle people holding you accountable, you shouldn't be doing this job. If you only listen to people when you like what they have to say, I'm going to give you a I'm going to stop you for just a moment. This is not, citizens comments are not intended to be anything personal with any of the commissioners or the two elected officials here. It's to deal with the topics that are going to be discussed at the meeting tonight. And I would say your comments are going to be towards the chairman. With respect, Vice respect. Chair, with you will not give us with respect, respect, Mr. Bird. So you have nothing to say as a full commissioner. You have absolutely nothing to say. You have nothing to say. And he can speak about whatever he wants to speak about. I understand it. First of all, attacks are not allowed, but he can speak about whatever he wants to speak about. I understand that. 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 I you addressed no, you, Mr. You Roberts, addressed you addressed the commission. You're showing your colors right now by telling a citizen he can't speak anymore about what's only on the agenda, and that's incorrect. Mr. Somebody Mr. of course you know that. Call me out of order. You want get the deputies to come here take me out. You're not going to do anything Mr. about Burke, it. You are out of order. Thank you, I appreciate way it. Out of order. But Mr. Roberts, as you can speak about whatever you want, as long as it's not, this is not offensive to an individual. Your behavior, Mr. You Mr. need to learn what, <laughs> what, what you need to learn. Oh, trust me, she knows what I have to say. She's getting ready to cry. Didn't want to cry. Mr. Don't tell me what's inappropriate or appropriate for my daughter. Mr. Burger, are you serious? Oh, don't listen to Courtney Marshall. What's right about government is what my daughter is going to learn. When you tell a citizen that he can't speak because somebody has no, a problem Mr. with it. Because there are certain aspects of every kind of commission that is not intended and for what is allowed is to speak Have about anything that's not on the agenda. agenda. He can speak about whatever is not on the agenda as he wants. In general, Mr. Berg, he is speaking about particular doesn't commissions. Matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Mr. Berg, you are way Mr. Roberts, out of line. just so you know, you yes, you cannot attack anybody on the commission personally. However, all I heard was you quote something. So you are, are not attacking, attacking anybody, not and commission. you can speak on anything that's not on Mr. the agenda. Mr. Berg, you are out of line. Absolutely not. not. Commission. It doesn't not matter what's by the commission or not. It absolutely is my commission. Guess what my term is? My term is Commissioner Byrne. My term is Commissioner Byrne. It doesn't matter. I'll end the meeting now unless and it changes the I'll end the meeting now unless you guys unless you calm down. Alright? If you have any per look, whatever happened in court today. Which in court? It's not it's personal. Personal. It has so, nothing to do with court. I know why you're here. You come here and quote me as a public official. I'm not a public official. Now, if you have any issues with the chair, there will be a time and place. Here's the agenda. The agenda is about an award. You want to speak about that award? Go ahead. Negative, Mr. Chair. You're out of so, order for that. You are out of order for that. So this is to come and speak about whatever they want. Can I speak as the legal counsel for Kenosha County? And I will try to clarify this. And I would respectfully <laughs> ask that everybody take it down a minute because this is not productive or helping anything. So with regards to citizen comments, I think we are all saying things that are correct, but we're all speaking over each other and we're getting confused. We do not limit the topics of citizen comments to what is on the agenda. People are free to speak about whatever they need to on citizen comments because we don't limit those. However, you cannot direct individuals specifically on the board and you do not make personal attacks or make anything personal during citizen comments. The chair has the authority at that point to stop because we should not be addressing anyone individually in citizen comments. It's not limited to what is on the agenda. However, it can be limited in time, and we would ask that it be respectful. We would ask that people not use vulgar language. We would ask that you know things like that do not happen, and I'm not at all suggesting that took place. I'm just saying those are the general parameters of what happens. I know, it's, I know we have strong feelings, but again, if we want the meeting to continue, we have to let the chair speak. 
he should be the ones calling people out of order. He should be the ones asking, you know, things of that nature. So again, I think citizen comments can be about anything. It's not limited to the agenda. However, I would ask that anyone that comes up to speak, please be professional, courteous. Do not direct members of the commission directly. Don't do any personal attacks. Don't do anything like that because that is inappropriate. And I believe that's what sort of was trying to, we were all saying the right thing. We're just saying things differently. So again, I think, I don't know how much time we have left um, with citizen comments here, but I think for the future, again, that you not direct anyone specifically. You can speak about anything, not what's just on the agenda. But let's try to take a breath and move forward. Otherwise, the meeting cannot go forward. So. Yeah, two minutes. So with regard, I will make it with respect to the topic here. The topic is changing the name of this. I believe as a citizen that there, that is not being done in the right spirit on behalf of the community. I believe that this is actually being done by smaller counter interests that have no interest in the public good. I think it's petty. I think it's small-minded. I think it's hurtful to the community. I think it's actually a waste of time to even be wasting interest and resources on this. I think if you look at what's going on in this community right now, you have a group who is acting in their own interest to the detriment of the community. People who have shown themselves consistently to not know the law, consistently to not know what's in the best interest of the community, consistently to be acting in their own interest. They speak one thing, they do another. You have been chosen as a group to be on this group. I believe I have a right to speak about you as a whole, as a group. I don't know who this group is representing. It's not representing the community. Small, petty factions have found a magical way to get on there, which fine, you got on there. Your time but, is up, but I'll give you 30 more seconds. I, that is not two minutes. You spoke during my time. You absolutely spoke during my time. Nice try. So as I was saying, small petty counter interest trying to silence the community on behalf of your petty interests. So what's happening here is pretty obvious. So I would be coming here every time to call out these individuals as a group that are acting detrimental to the community. Time's up. Don't move on. I'm sorry, I was saying. I had stopped the clock, Mr. Roberts, just so you know, I was starting to that. And for the record, you have more than three minutes. We can't hear you. And for the record, he had more than three minutes. Any more comments? <laughs> 